Hello dear students, in this video we will solve this question. 5 mole of Fe2O3 and 6 mole of CO react according to the equation below. What is the limiting reactant and how many moles of the excess reactant remain unreacted? So, uh, firstly we have to understand that what is the limiting reactant, right? Limiting reactant is that reactant which used up completely in the reaction. So, uh, according to the equation, if one mole of Fe2O3 reacts with 3 moles of CO, then it will produce 2 Fe and 3 CO2 molecules. So, we can say that 3 times of CO amount react with the Fe2O3. So, uh, moles of Fe2O3 are given 5 moles. So, if 5 moles of Fe2O3, uh, Fe2O3 are given, then they will react 3 times with the CO. So, 5 multiplied 3 is equal to 15. So, 5 moles of Fe2O3 react with 15 mole of CO. But here, uh, actually 6 moles are present. 6 moles are given. So, uh, this is the limiting reactant because this will completely used up. Or in another words, we can say if 6 moles of CO are given, then they react with 1 by 3 times Fe2O3. So, if 6 moles are there, then they will react 6 divided by 3, 2. 2 moles of Fe2O3. But here are present 5 moles. So, it is in the excess amount. So, Fe2O3 is the excess reactant and CO is the limiting reactant. So, CO. CO is present in A and B option. Then, uh, we have to calculate how many moles of the excess reactant remain unreacted. So, how, ki, uh, how we can uh, find this? Uh, we can see that this is the limiting reactant. This will used up completely. So, 6 moles will react with 2 moles of Fe2O3. But here are present 5 moles. So, excess amount is 5 minus 2 which will actually use in the reaction. So, remaining amount is 3 moles. So, excess amount remain unreacted is 3 moles. So, answer should be B option. Let's check the mark scheme. Mark scheme also shows that B option is right. So, uh, this is how we can solve this question. Thank you so much for watching and all the best.